How's it going everybody? Mr. Postile here and this is just a quick video. Wasn't planning on making this. It's been a work day. Haven't been feeling good but just wanted to say that today is pre-order day for my arcade game station pro. You know that little box that now has the SD card thingy in it that you can put the Atari games on and stuff and it has the Atari games built in. It's kind of like where's it at? It's kind of like these little flashback systems that I have some of. You know, with Atari games in it, only it's by my arcade. So I don't want to spend a lot of time on this, but launch day. Much to our surprise, us that went and pre-ordered from the My Arcade website back when it first became available. Uh, to our surprise, all of a sudden, the Costco's got it. And people were buying this off the floor displays at Costco's for $20 cheaper. No big deal. Good for them. I don't have a Costco anywhere around me and then last week i think target had them for the regular retail price people could run out to target and buy it uh closest target to me is about 30 minutes away i'm not going to do that i had it pre-ordered anyway what they got it a week ahead of time i don't have to have it day one but i have mine set back and ordered that's fine enough for me but today tonight right around 6 p.m i believe it was i get an email saying that they can't fulfill the orders I'll put it up here what I got from them and uh, normally I sit back and if I get something like that I mean no big deal to me but the more I think about it the more I think I don't want to sound like a whiny biatch here but it is kind of bullshit to wait until evening the day of when these are supposed to ship uh, way to wait till the last second to send out this email to people and say mm, there's a delay we don't have enough of them well, you had enough of them to make whatever deals you made with Costco and Target to put them out there for people that maybe didn't pre-order and uh, just have them sitting on the shelf for them. Uh, you really should fulfill your orders to the people that pre-ordered first, in my humble opinion. It's not often you see me rant about something like this. And again, I have a zillion and one ways to play these games. Maybe some other people didn't. And I like to have the pre-order as like a placeholder to know that I have my copy of something there, like with my Ghosts and Goblins cabinet from Tick Cab the Cabinet from New Wave Toys. But uh, yeah, the more I thought about it, the more I thought maybe I will just put a little rant video out there for you. So uh, that's my opinion. Like I said I'll put it up here what they sent. I just think it's kind of bullshit, my arcade, that you waited till six o'clock in the evening, the day of when you're supposed to be sending out. You know, they're supposed to be in the mail packaged up. Not necessarily get it today, but it should be on its way to us. Now you say maybe a few days, who knows what the real truth is there. But that's it. This is Mr. Postal, another great Mr. Postal video. A delay from my arcade for our game station pros for those of us that pre-order. Again, I'm I'm not driving a half hour to Target to get it. I can wait on mine, but I'll do better next time. That's all I gotta say. That's all I gotta say. Later. Oh, Nacho. Come here, Nacho. No biting. No biting. Ooh, no biting. Oh, Nacho, stop.